France sparked further doubt on the spread of the coronavirus after doctors at a hospital in the suburbs of Paris said one of their patients appeared to have had the virus as early as December after tests were repeated. France was originally believed to have recorded its first coronavirus case in late January like many other countries across Europe. But on Sunday Professor Yves Cohen from the Avicenne Hospital in Bobigny, 5.7 miles from Paris, said a second set of tests on a patient hospitalized in December showed COVID-19 was already in the country at the end of 2019. Professor Cohen said he and colleagues made the shocking discovery after carrying out the coronavirus test on samples collected in December. Speaking to BFM TV, the French physician said, we've reanalyzed all negative tests on people who were diagnosed with pneumonia. Of the 24 patients, we found one who resulted positive to COVID-19 on December 27 when he was taken to our Avicenne Hospital. Asked again to confirm whether the samples matched results to the coronavirus tests, Professor Cohen once again confirmed his diagnosis. He continued, yes, it matched. We've controlled twice and it matched again, so we have COVID-19 in December. The shocking findings have sent shockwaves through the French scientific community, due to previous beliefs suggesting the novel coronavirus had not spread to France until January to February 2020. Speaking to France Blue after the findings, Professor Cohen insisted the patient had as well and has fully recovered, as have his children. Professor Fabian Cohen, a spokesman for Mondor Hospital in the Val de Marne, admitted he did not feel surprised as concerns over a new pandemic had begun to circulate in November. Professor Cohen said, we have been worried since November 2019, we already knew that there was this risk of an epidemic and that we had to protect the elderly in particular. BBC Europe editor Katya Adler wrote on Twitter, causing a stir in France this eve, Dr. Eve Cohen says his hospital retested the blood of patients treated in December for pneumonia. Found a man whose blood tested positive for hashtag coronavirus this was the 27th of December. Before hashtag COVID-19 was thought to have arrived in France. As of Monday morning, France recorded over 168,000 cases of COVID-19, 24,898 of whom have died since the outbreak begun. But Professor Cohen's finding at Bobigny put into question the official death toll as earlier cases of the novel coronavirus and subsequent deaths may have gone undetected. It comes as a new poll from BFM TV found support in Emmanuel Macron's strategy to tackle the pandemic has fallen considerably in the past few weeks. The Alab survey of 1,000 French adults conducted between April 28-19 found only 38% of respondents have confidence in Mr. Macron and his government. An overwhelming 62% admitted they don't trust their leader, a seven-point increase from a poll carried out on April 21. France is due to begin easing lockdown measure on May 11, with shops and some schools reopening after eight weeks of near-complete shutdown. Prime Minister Édouard Philippe conceded the lockdown dealt a heavy blow to the French economy but estimated social distancing measures helped more than 60,000 lives.